Hello, Timmy Napso here, Executive Vice President of Fortis Pay. We're discussing Amazon Alexa's launch into the business world and what the possibilities are of Alexa entering the business world. So far as we know, Alexa has been you know, powering many homes. They've become quite powerful in the home automation space. Uh, people can now order things just by talking to Alexa, find out what the weather is, uh, the news, uh, you know, any appointments that they may have. Uh, they've done a really good job of simplifying uh, and streamlining the home experience and we're just watching this get better. Turn on the lights, turn off the lights, so on and so forth. Uh, now, what's interesting to think about is how would that interact with a business? Really cool concept. You know, you can schedule a meeting, make an appointment. You can actually, in a hotel type setting, ask for the lights to be turned on and off, set an alarm, all through voice activation. And hotels obviously are looking to make the guest experience better. And how they've done that is saying, well, in you know today's age, right? We're looking at the future being Alexa. In today's age, if you want to set a alarm or a wake up call, you would have to call the front desk to do so. Well, in the day of Alexa, you could just say, set a wake up call for 6 a.m. tomorrow and it would set that wake up call for you. So it's really interesting to see how Alexa can get into the business world. In addition to that, the automation of the lighting system of curtains and shades in conference rooms, throughout hotel rooms, can be quite powerful. Um, they're also doing integrations to products like Salesforce, in addition, other large products that allow them to create automations based on what's actually happening with the CRM that's actually running the business. So really curious to see how this is gonna play out and how it's going to work. Um, really also wanting to know your comments on how Alexa can affect businesses in both, both a positive and negative nature. Uh, thanks for listening.